Hey everybody, welcome back to another video. Hope you guys have been enjoying the content on the channel as of late. And, uh, uh, you know, just, you know, just trying to sh make more content. Uh, just a little bit behind, uh, to be frank. So, uh, there might be a day that's empty. I don't know. Uh, we'll see. Uh, I'm kind of wanting the streak to be intact until, uh, the year ends, you know? So, we have, like, literally what like two weeks so you know hopefully we can make it um because by the end of the year or by next year basically it's going to be uh a little bit different and we'll do a whole update video with regards to, like you know stuff that's happening but um but anyways um i had this thought that i had last night or was it two nights ago i don't know um and like, it's something that I'm pretty sure you guys have thought about, which is about, you know, bad movies, you know, just like bad content, you know, just not good stuff, you know. And the thing that I think people, most people probably don't realize is that despite all that bad content that you're watching, right, despite how um how awful it is you know and even the intentions behind it even if they're not the most sound even if they're fairly questionable um like they all set out to try to make something good because as far as i i can tell um just by the, the label of art and just the 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 purpose of it nobody ever has ever strived to make a bad movie like that's something that i've noticed is that nobody has ever strived to make a bad movie and some of you might think that that there's an argument for that you know and you know i can probably think of a few examples of films that people might use as like as as uh you know as illustrations of oh this see this was a guy who was making a bad movie and knew he was making a bad movie like i think the room is probably an example um now the room's an interesting case uh firstly i actually have not seen the film but i've seen it parodied like everywhere um i've seen some scenes from it as well i mean yeah it, it it's not good from what i've seen um but tommy was was wanting to make a movie like he was wanting to make a good movie you know like he didn't strive out to make a bad movie um and the unfortunate thing also about the room is that the room is like 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 i think people are like abusing tommy wazo because it's like they give him this false idea that his movie is somehow um resonating with people or that people are like like um like responding to it when really what people are doing is that like they're just mocking it and it's become a classic in such mockery in such bullying and such that you know it's like like you know that's what it is i mean i say bullying because ultimately like that's how we're treating it you know we're not we're not just being straight 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 up and saying that it's just terrible like like, we're kind of giving it the benefit of the doubt. We're saying, oh, it's terrible, but, you know. It's like, even though everyone will tell you the room is just terrible. I've heard nothing but terrible things about it. Um, so, like, you know. But Tommy Wiseau wanted to make a good movie, you know. And I think, and, and all filmmakers want to make a good movie. Like, like you have to be a real genius to make a piece of crap with the intention of making a piece of crap you know like there, you have to be like either incredibly smart or you don't have you have to know have like zero um or well no not really like 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 it's impossible to make a bad movie like like, literally by that definition it's impossible to make a bad movie now you can make a bad movie through the intent of making something good like that's we've seen that many times but 
to sit down and say, let's make a bad movie. That's impossible. You can't do that. I've never seen anybody just go into production saying, this is going to be a piece of shit and have it come out and be a piece of shit. Like, you know, we've seen movies parody bad movies. We've seen movies try to make take jokes from bad movies, you know, like referencing bad material. But we've never, I've never seen anybody just go, you know what? We're just going to sit down and dedicate like a week or two and make just a pile of trash. Like, even if, I feel like even if you were to do that, the quality, would, you're still striving for good quality. Like, that's the thing. Even though you're doing a piece of trash, somewhere within your your uh, your purpose, you're still looking for good quality. Like, you know. Like, like even the worst thing I've ever seen, the worst thing being, like, Wavelength. You know, that thing, god-awful. Like, just, I cannot believe that something like that exists. But, um, like, even that has, um, like, like, there's in there are uh, passions behind it, even if it's just staring at a fucking wall. Like, it's, there's still somebody behind the camera wanting to have made something good, you know, wanting to have made some form of artistry even though i think it's just fucking ridiculous and just yeah like it's an interesting interesting thought because i've never i've never seen that and i don't think it's possible i don't think you can actually make like a bad movie i don't think you actually can um we've seen many terrible movies there are loads of terrible movies out there but none of those movies were made with the intent to be bad all those movies were made with the intent to make something good, you know, and they had a vision to them, you know, but I've never seen anyone just go, you know what, let's make something bad. And if they, if that was, if that ever was the case, they still are wishing to make something good inherently, like they're still make, wanting to make something inherently good, you know, in terms of quality, you know, so yeah i don't know I, it was just an interesting thought that i had today or a few days ago it was like no one's ever done that and i don't know if, if it's even possible you know like because the knowledge that you have of filmmaking prevents it you can't and also just just by design what you're what you're setting out to do you're already setting yourself up to do to try to to try to do something good you know even if the idea is to make something bad, you know, like psychologically, like you can tell yourself that you're making a piece of shit, but you're hope you're still putting passion into it. You're still wanting a certain quality, you know. I guess if you're wanting to make something bad, you don't. You just do the first take, and then you just move on. You know, I, I, I guess that's what you what would be considered a bad movie at that point, but. But who's to say that that first take is not brilliant? Who's to say that that first take is not amazing? It's or just okay, you know? Um, so, I don't know. Maybe you guys have seen it, but I, 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 would, I would have to imagine that the movies that you bring up uh, more than likely were made with good intentions or were made with a passion for the craft or made you know to make a good movie i i like show me a film where it was made to be bad it was it was a it was made to be bad they went they sought out to make a bad movie and then tell me how the quality of it i guarantee you it's still probably not as not as bad you know because they didn't really set out to do that they just they just they, they they say they're doing that, but ultimately they they weren't doing that because they still had had a care for what they were making. So, you know, but you know, just an interesting thought. Um, but you guys don't know. Have you guys seen like the 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 question is? Have you guys seen a movie that was made to be bad? You know. 
Like, it has to have been made to be bad. I have never seen it, and I don't think it ever will, has existed. But you guys let me know. You guys let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. And that's going to be it for me, guys. Thank you guys for tuning in. And until then, I will catch you guys in the next video. Bye.